Hi, this is Dave Chenault with Skylight Systems, and this short video is going to take you on a tour of our new SharePoint hosted app called Sidekick 365 DCM. Sidekick 365 DCM is a way for you to manage case files that contain a lot of tasks and documents. So think of them as a very smart folder. And what's really great is this is one of the first solutions that has been developed that takes advantage of the new app model in SharePoint. What it does is it takes all the capabilities of SharePoint and packages it up so that you can quickly install a solution in a matter of moments and have this capability in your SharePoint environment. That can be in Office 365 up in the cloud or on premise on your SharePoint 2013 farm. It's very easy to install. It's a single click and away you go. So let's take a look at how this system works, how the app works, and some of the capabilities. The main thing about this app is it's all organized around case files. And a case file has information related to a particular topic. So let's look at this loan 2299. We'll take a quick look at this one. And what you'll see is this one has four documents and one task all about this particular loan. And it's very easy to add in a document or a task to this loan. So here's the first three of the documents and the task. And if we want to see all the documents, just click on the tab here. And we can see them all listed here for us. Now, since it's built on SharePoint, there's a lot of interesting capabilities that come with the solution. You have things like sort capabilities. You have things like you can do filtering, et cetera. And I'll get into that in a few moments. But one thing to notice is here we've got an Excel file, a PowerPoint file, an email file, and a Word file. And in another video, I show you how we've built integration to save directly from these um, Microsoft Office uh, solutions right into our app. You can also have scan files, and we have a separate uh, video that describes that capability as well. So the idea is this is a very rich uh, way to store a lot of information about a particular topic. And we have customers that use this for loan processing, HR case management, customer service, the list goes on and on. And it's very scalable. It runs in Office 365 in the cloud or on your servers using SharePoint 2013. And we have one customer with over a million scanned pages currently in Office 365 and it's growing by about 10,000 images per week. So let's go back to the overview of the case and just take a quick tour of what's here. We've got a title and a case number, etc. And the red stars mean that these are required. Okay. So how does the system work? How do I add a case? All you do, it's very simple. You just come to the drop down that says create new, select a case, and you'll be presented with a screen to create a new case. So I'll call this one 2289-Jones, um, uh, uh, and I'll say this one's the loan number in this case. could be whatever you want. And it was opened up uh, the 19th. And the status is open. And who owns this? Well, I will um, make this uh, right now an admin. And the description is it's a loan file for uh, Mr. Jones. And that's enough. And now I can go ahead and save this. Now I have a case. And I'm now able to start saving information into that case. OK, I've built the structure. And there's a lot of ways for me to get information in. I can come in here to Documents. And I can just say New Item here and browse to select one. Or I can use the integration we've built that lets you save directly from um, one of the popular Office applications. You can also scan into it, save it from email, etc. And there's another video on that. So that's the basic idea. The same thing for tasks. You can then go into a task and create a new task item just by selecting new and give it a name, it's, assign it to somebody, etc. and track the status. Okay. So the idea is pretty simple, but it's very powerful because this application, this app, has a lot of uses. If you think about all the things where you're trying to get a lot of information together that's coming at you from all different sides and organize that and then have a team of people work on it together, it's extremely powerful. Let's look at this one again for Williams and show a couple other capabilities. Let's go in and open up, for example, um, an Excel spreadsheet. And what you'll notice, because I'm using Office 365, is I'm able to use the Excel web app. And this lets me then view the content right in the browser. And I can edit it with other people if I uh, want to online. So it's leveraging all the capabilities that SharePoint brings to the table and packaging it up into a very nice solution that's easy for folks to use. 
Okay, so let's look at a couple of other interesting things I can do. Let's look at cases. And let's look at a few things like filtering. So if I come in here and I say I want to see just the cases that belong to Karen Berg, just by selecting that drop down arrow and that checkbox, again I'm leveraging SharePoint. So now it's going in and I can now see just the cases that Karen owns. I can clear those out as well. And I can do things like this. I can hit the case number and I can sort, let me close that, I can sort up, can sort down, etc. I can do things based on the status of the of the different um, items. I can say show me just the open ones, etc. So you get the idea. I have a lot of capabilities in these uh, headers that again I pick up because I'm leveraging SharePoint. I can also do things like searching within the list. I could say I want to find um, information around Downey. So just type that in and hit save. And what you'll see, um, if I type it in properly, is I'll get um, a list of the loans that belong to Downey, et cetera. And if I go to the main page, I could do a search on the, everything in it, find any documents, et cetera, associated with it. Last thing is I have a list of categories. And this categories list is used to classify different kinds of files. And it's very easy to add a category. So this is a very interesting uh, solution. It's leveraging all of the SharePoint capabilities. It's packaged it up into an app and it's very easy for you to install it through the store. Microsoft has built a store online called Apps for SharePoint and the apps featured in the store and you can download it and it'll install into your environment very simply. So again I don't want to uh, go into too much detail in this video, just wanted to show you a quick overview of Sidekick 365 DCM. We've got some other videos on our website at www.skylightsystems.com that will show you more capabilities. And also if you want more information just email us at www.skylightsystems.com that's S-K-Y-L-I-T-E uh, and you can e email that to info at skylightsystems.com and that will get us an in email and we'll get right back to you. Okay, thanks very much for your time. I hope you enjoyed the video.